Hi everyone, Paul Morbid here, Morbid Team Entertainment. What we're going to do is, um, I'm with uh, fr some friends of uh, different types of bands and this type of thing, and you're going to listen to some sounds and some sound effects for uh, my uh, experimental horror film, SIG, it's all about choice. And uh, we're going to get to listen to some different types of instruments and this type of thing, and then more importantly also, I'm looking for some sound effects for the film. Alright, so more to come on that. So, I got some really good music and sounds uh, from that uh, music jam, and that worked out quite well. So I'm going to have to put a lot of that together and see what I can come out of it, and uh, mixing and so forth, and get some good analog mixture with that and see how it turns out. So far I'm really excited with it. They come up with some really interesting and creepy stuff uh, for SIJ. It's all about choice. As you can see behind me, still got a lot of work to do on my Bolex. It's just going to take uh, a lot of time and that forth. But we got to get it done before 2023. So back to work. So the motion picture camera I'm using is a Bolex 16mm. And uh, here's just a look inside of all the gears. It is an analog camera, of course, so I gotta make sure all this works properly and smoothly. Lubricate it and the whole deal. At this point, my Bolex is dismantled to a decent degree. I've got the front of it off called the turret, and on the upper part up here at the top of the camera, my, the frame would be the viewfinder. So I gotta get everything set. It's a silent camera, which is great for filming in, in the Philippines, as we know everything's loud. So you just simply wind it up with this handle right here. Just give it as many revolutions as you like, and crank it up just like that. And then press the film button. The film button is located here, and then there's one up front. The 16 millimeter, 100 foot spool of film is loaded here then through over to the take up and there would be a turret of course on here but of course as we as i pointed out i'm servicing the camera the film button one of them is located here i press it with my thumb right now i'm testing everything inside and out and around it so when i go to film during production time i would just press Just like that. So right now I'm just testing every gear and everything here and everything out and around the camera. Just a little bit of history for you and uh, knowledge about the camera, what we'll be filming with here in the Philippines. Okay, so this is probably one of the effects I've been, uh, when testing, I'm going to film more than likely first. And it's a headache, it, you know, it's, it's a gore effect on a head. So I've got some tubing right here. It goes all the way around and I've got it connected to, as you can see right here, the tubing on the back of the head. So that's going to hit probably the back of a wall, you know, that type of thing. And it's cheaper to use a fake head when you're testing the effects rather than have the actor there all the time so you can get all the problems and everything worked out to detail what you want to do. All right, so that's where I'm at this point. Still testing this, get it exactly the way I want it, all the angles and that type of thing for in the frame. Okay? All right, Paul Morbid of Morbid Team Entertainment. Until next time, do a subscribe. See ya.